making his way to the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds. The most decorated combat athlete in history. Brock Lesnar is hazardous to your health. You know, the night after WrestleMania back in 2015, Brock Lesnar F5'd me out of my shoes on Monday Night Raw. <laughs> yeah, I remember that one. You know what, Byron? It really made my career because you replaced me on play-by-play -play and the world realized how bad you were and how good I was on that night. So in a weird sort of way, I thank Brock Lesnar for that. That is kind of weird. But I've talked to a lot of superstars who have faced Brock Lesnar and there is one common denominator between them all. They say once you are in... Pretty incredible what this man has accomplished in his career. Jinder Mahal has worked for everything that he has, but now everything that he has is the best in the world. First class all the way. Airplanes, limousines. That newly found lifestyle, Corey, a direct result of the changes Jinder Mahal underwent from changing his body to reshaping his mind, his confidence, his outlook on life. Try this out with me, Byron. Take a deep breath. Shanti. Uh, Shanti. Shan Shanti. I don't feel anything, Corey. The Hall of Famer is here! Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 249 pounds, the Rated R Superstar, Edge. Edge has accomplished everything in his career. Yeah, Cornerstone, one of the forefathers of the tables, ladders, and chairs match. Not to mention, Byron, the important fact that he totally reeks of awesomeness. And along with Christian, the creator of the five-second pose. The ultimate opportunist. And so it begins. Wow. Despite triple threats being every man for himself, history has shown that the match's dynamics can create unlikely alliances. A participant must be ready to endure double team attacks at any time. Aside from Saxton's commentary, this has all the makings of an epic match. Brock Lesnar still enters every match as the odds on favorite. Yeah, I would never predict a Lesnar loss, Saxton, because you can enter Suplex City, but you will never come out the same. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Tremendous damage to the neck. Taken down with authority. This superstar comes in here tonight with a pretty impressive ranking, guys. And well-deserved, too, if you ask me. Bang right to the face. On the shoulders here. 
And it could be a long way down from there. Momentum's firmly in his corner now. Now it's Lesnar taking some punishment. Looks like he may have let his guard down there for a moment, and it cost him. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. Impressive ranking for the superstar indeed, but just because you're in the top 10 doesn't make you unstoppable. We've seen superstars with all the momentum in the world lose matches before. It happens all the time. Hey, Owen Hart pinned Bret Hart on the same night that the Hitman would set the challenge for the WWE Championship at WrestleMania 10. There's a perfect example of what you're talking about right there. Only two men in WWE history can lay claim to overcoming the Money in the Bank cash-in. One is, we got a cover. Looking to steal one there, perhaps. The Maharaja refusing to stay down. And no luck against Edge there. I'm going to resume Jinder's Money in the Bank transaction. It's tough being a first-time champion, but that briefcase looming has to make it even harder. Mahal got a lot of weight off his shoulders with a roll-up victory over How did he do that? I don't know, Michael, but good thing. I don't think he could have taken much more of that. What a nasty knee. Oh, boy, he is rolling. No, he reverses it. Slam put him in a bad way, guys. Normally, we hear plenty of debates surrounding the weekly power rankings, but this week, it seems both fans and superstars alike agree with how everything shook out. He's making a statement here with this attack. Mahal and the strike lands. Can he finish the job? No, oh, a kick out. Yeah, he's made a career of walking that edge, and he shows no signs of stopping. Yeah, not too much debate over the rankings this week. The edge is sizing an execution. What's he going to do now? Cut. Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the beast. A sickening thud as he lands hard. Edge is starting to move slow. His chances of winning this triple threat match are starting to dwindle. Looking for an opening for that finisher, it seems, and that's a smart move. Edge! There! I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. The winning edge, this one's done. He's got him covered. And he breaks the cover. <laughs> yeah. Try again. There is no way that is going to topple the Beast Incarnate. Right to the face. Wow. I the damage has been done. Wow. I got to say, I don't want to know what that feels like. Wow. I got to say that I'm in shock. I really thought Lesnar would look better here tonight. Brock Lesnar is in a real bad spot here. Anytime a superstar sees an opening for their finisher, they got to take it, as Byron was saying. A long gate counter here. Oh, boy. He is rolling. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. Rough landing on that one. I can't believe what I'm seeing. And no luck against Edge there. Goes with a scoop slam. He has him right where he wants him. This is what makes he's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Getting in with a strike like that lets you know just what kind of fight you're in. His clothesline finds the mark. Oh, hanging off for dear life. That might be it. I can't believe what I'm seeing. This could do it. One. Lesnar easily powers out. Not yet. Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the beast. 
He may get the three count right there. Well, that was a close call. Well, the R in the rated R superstar stands for really, as in he's really good. for the finish. Mahal is looking to end this. Oh, wow. That might have done it, Cole. Jinder Mahal might have just set the end of this match in motion. And there's the kick out. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. Uh-oh, and from behind. Jinder Mahal is not going to like this. Showing some quickness there. Set him up for Russian leg sweep. One. Back body draw. Oh, you see the height on that? He's making a statement here with this attack. An impressive strike there. And he goes for the pen. At two and a half. I don't know where he's finding the strength to stay in this one. Mahal is looking to end this. Gun check. That's how you put an exclamation point on a match. Brock Lesnar is in a. He may get the three count right here. I think so. Oh, somehow. Wow, if you want to be Brock Lesnar, you've got to finish him because he's never going to say die. That'll put you in a world of trouble. He thinks he has it. Two. And he got a near fall out of it. So resilient. Here we go. Brock Lesnar is setting it up. The Impaler. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Someone's going to be black and blue tomorrow. It just doesn't appear to be Edge's night tonight. Three! Yes! Takes it! And here's another look at some incredible action from a match that we're not likely to stop talking about for a long, long time. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history. This entire match was just one big highlight reel, and I didn't expect anything else. Here is your winner, Jinder Mahal. Now that's eking out a win. Let's not overcomplicate things. This business is simple. It's all about wins and losses, and it sure looks to me like somebody has figured that out. What a great match we just saw here on Raw. Thank you to everybody at home for choosing to spend part of your Monday night with us.